Hi, welcome to Best Farm Animals. Today we're going to discuss the three best chickens to raise for meat. Raising meat chickens has become increasingly popular today. If you're looking to raise chickens for meat, it's important to decide what matters the most to you when raising chickens for consumption. There are several factors to consider to determine the best chicken breeds to raise for meat. At the end of the video, I will give you some things to consider so you can determine the best chicken breeds for you. So what are the three best chicken breeds to raise for meat? Our third favorite is the Dorking Chicken. Dorkings have stout, rectangular bodies, horizontal backs, and large heads. Their tails are set high, and they have red combs, earlobes, and wattles. Dorkings are well fleshed in the breast, wings, and wishbone areas. They are large birds with especially tender meat. They have good flavor too, which is usually preferred to other meat birds in taste tests. Dorkings can be used for dual purpose chickens. They lay a moderate amount of eggs, which works well for both small and large flocks. Dorking roosters grow around nine pounds and the hens grow to around seven pounds. The hens lay about 140 to 180 large creamy white eggs per year. However, after about 35 to 50 eggs, the hens tend to go a little broody. They are good mothers and stay with their chicks longer than most, most other breeds. Dorkings are mellow, calm birds that will get along with children and other chickens. Next is ranger chickens. Rangers are a hybrid chicken that is specifically bred for meat production. They are raised during the summer and processed for meat just before fall. They are moderately growing, so they can be harvested at about six and a half pounds in about nine weeks. As a result, they have more tender meat and higher fat than a Cornish cross. Their meat is also considered healthier to eat than Cornish cross. Rangers are almost never used for egg production. The hens will lay eggs, but the chicks won't come out as rangers. These hens lay about three to four light brown eggs per week. However, they won't start laying until about 16 weeks. Because of this, rangers are generally raised short term for meat production. Last, we have the Cornish Cross. Cornish Cross is the meat bird of the commercial industry. They are large, fast growing chickens. They are also considered a hybrid breed. Cornish Cross chickens are only ever raised for their meat. They are white with a pink single comb. They have a mild flavor and are the cheapest meat chickens to raise for the market. Males grow as much as six pounds in six weeks with hens growing about four and a half pounds in the same time period. They grow so fast that they don't do well to breed or raise long term. Cornish cross do better in cooler, mild weather and they don't, they don't do well in high altitude areas or hot areas. One problem is they can die of dehydration even when water is close because of how lethargic they can become. Cornish cross chickens have a good feed weight ratio that makes them the cheapest breed to raise for meat use. For more information about the three best chickens to raise for their meat, check out our article, Best Chickens to Raise for Meat, Fast Growth and Great Flavor. You may also enjoy our article, 17 Best Dual Purpose Chickens that Lay Well and Fatten Nicely. All right, so some things to consider when determining the best chicken breeds for meat are first, meat chicken breeds usually grow to butcher weight faster than other heritage and dual, pur dual purpose chicken breeds. Second, specific meat breeds are beloved for their unique flavor and are considered a delicacy in some parts of the world. And third, most meat breeds have a very low feed to weight ratio compared with other chicken breeds. To learn more about chickens and other animals, check out our YouTube channel and our website, bestfarmanimals.com. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. Thank you.